You remember graduation night? You were nailing Tina Scotto. No, I was actually having the best night of my life with your sister. What? You defraud my sister? And I know all the details? Ah! 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 What it is, world? I am Zay Zay, and welcome to another banging interview. I'm here with the stars of the movie, 30 minutes or less, and I gotta tell you that it's so, so funny. Aziz Ansari, Jesse Eisenberg. How you guys doing, man? Great. Great. Thank yeah. you so much for taking time to speak with us and watching the movie. Oh my gosh, yo. I, I, it's kind of a sleeper. I'll be, I'll be honest with you. It doesn't have the same kind of, I mean, every time you turn on the television, you're, you're bombarded with movie images. And this one's kind of a sleeper. It's just creeping in, but oh my gosh, the experience is incredible. Oh, but tell us what the movie's about, just in case people don't know yet. Uh, the movie is uh, me and this guy play best friends, and uh, he's a pizza delivery guy, and I'm a third grade history teacher. Mm -hmm. And uh, early in the movie, his character gets kidnapped by these bad guys and they put a bomb on him and tell him he has to rob a bank and get him $100,000. Right. And uh, he has nowhere to turn to but me, his best friend, to help him. And so it's kind of a movie about two regular guys who are forced to rob a bank and what would they do? Last night, two guys in masks jumped me and strapped a bomb to my chest. Now I have less than nine hours to rob a bank. Ring, ring. Oh, look, Bear's calling. Hello, Bear. Wait, what do you mean you couldn't rob the bank? <laughs> Whoa, okay. Yeah, I like that bear. I don't even know you. If the roles were reversed, like let's say for instance you had the bomb on, what would have been different in this film? I would have never helped him. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> That's not cool. That's not no, cool. No, no. That was nice. See, you know, everybody looking at you like, wow. Yeah. Everybody, <laughs> cool, man. Everybody is just you two. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone watching at home. <laughs> Jesse, you've been in, in a myriad of movies. I mean, you've been in, in different types of things. What do you prefer? Do you prefer the comedy, or do you prefer like the dramatic roles, you know? Uh, I've been in different types of movies, but my job really doesn't change. Like in this movie, my character has a bomb strapped to him and he's put in this very stressful situation. So for him, it's it's a drama, you know? So okay. you know, the movie maybe appears funny, but for him, it's the most dramatic day of his life. Is that thing real? And if I don't get them their money in time, this thing is gonna blow. And your first thought was to come to a school filled with young children? What was the biggest surprise you, you caught between the TV and the film? Like, well, when you got to the film world, it was like, what, we don't have There's... to wipe our own butts? Like, what, what's the, <laughs> what's, <laughs> what's been the biggest? Uh... Um, the, 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 uh, in, the, in the movie, um, there, there's like more M&Ms and stuff on set. They have more food budget. <laughs> more snacks. You guys were really good together. Do you think we're gonna see anything else together in the future? Maybe. Uh, I would. I would. Yeah, I would love it. Action maybe, comedy yeah, team. Maybe, maybe we can reboot the Rush Hour franchise, and he can be the Jackie Chan person. <laughs> Please sell me this movie. Why do I have to go see 30 Minutes or Less? Please go see 30 Minutes or Less. I'm in the movie, he's in the movie. If you see it financially, it'll benefit us and then we'll get to do more films. And also it's funny, so it's a win for everyone, please. And uh, the first person to see the movie gets a free car. <laughs> <laughs> Homeboy's got the federales in hot pursuit. Let me concentrate, okay? I do this for a living. No you don't, you get high and deliver pizzas. That's nothing like this situation. Whoa, that guy got messed up! Drop your weapons! Put your hands on your head! Guess what? You just brought a gun to a bomb fight, officer! Oh.